get into the jog. Come on. Jog it out. Right now we're doing, I can't read what I put up there to do. <laughs> Three minute jog. The font shrunk when I did something else and came back to it. So three minute jog right now. That's what we're into. And I honestly don't know 100% what the timer thing was on because I didn't start it over again. So we're gonna get roughly three minute jogging. We're just gonna jog it out right now. Jog, run, whatever your body feels up to. Then we're gonna do 30 seconds of high knees followed by 30 seconds of butt kicks and then 30 seconds of jumping jacks. Then we're gonna go into a two minute run and repeat it again. So this is day 29 of the hard reset. So there's 29 and then there's 30. Then, so today's the hard, tougher one. Tomorrow's a little bit easier. Then Wednesday I put together kind of like a cardio core one to do. Thursday, I'm starting a combat one that was in there. I've done this actually before, but we'll mix it up a little bit as we're going through it. So it'll be day one of combat on Thursday. But Friday is a day one of a different cardio one that's in there. So I'm gonna mix the two together to kind of make it so it's not the same all the time. And then depending on what's on schedule, if I wanna do the course on Wednesday, if it falls in where there is a core, I'll move it around to work with one of theirs. Normally there is one that focuses on it. So have fun with it. I'll just keep working through, work through the two of them through December and probably into January. As the challenge starts January, if you're doing it with me, we're gonna be doing, tightening it up on the diet. I have a plan that I'm putting together and then we're gonna be doing workouts depending on what you're focusing and what your level is. If you're trying to lose weight, you're going to up the cardio. If you're trying to build muscle, you're going to up the weights and do more weight training. I'm going to do a happy medium for an overall. I might do a little bit more cardio on my side. We'll see. But um, I'm going to do more of a happy medium between the two where you will do this is it or repeat it. Or you may not even do as much as I do on one or the other, depending on where your level is. There will be a cardio a weight and a core every day and then for monday actually monday tuesday wednesday i mean wednesday's not thursday friday there's a weights cardio's every day wednesday will be cardio stretching and core and saturdays we kind of like have a mixture of a cardio and weight mixed together depending on what's going on with that one. Or you could leave the weights off and just do the cardio if you want to, or you could combine them together either way. Or you could see what the weight is and focus more on that if that's what you want to do. But then Sundays are rest and recovery days. Push it hard for four weeks. Then we're gonna up it, I mean, I'm running over because I'm talking, but we're gonna up it even more for the fifth week. It's gonna be really tight. I haven't found out yet, but it's going to be really intense for the fifth week. But then the sixth week is going to be cardio and stretching mainly with some light weights in there. Take care of the body after pushing it really hard. All right, are we ready for this? I think I've chipper jabbered enough. Let's get to our high knees in three, two, one. 30 seconds of high knees. Get them up, get them up. You can do marching if you want to. But tomorrow's more marches. Come on. Halfway there. Keep it going. We're going into butt kicks after this one. And butt kickers, go. We get to do jumping jacks. Jumping jacks are next. In three, two, one.
second, and back to a jog. Next, three, two, one. It's not exact anyways when I do these, right? We just kind of go with it. Have some fun. Okay. So, in January, you need to figure out where's your focus going to be? What do you want to push for? And then, I was working through, I need to add more for the meal plan options. But I got to the meal plan options yesterday. And I did one for, this is a mixture. It's not a, carb fat day. It's a balanced one. And I'll do one now for if you do like to do carb rotations. Carb one day, fat another type day. I'll do one of those and add it on to it. But I have to reread the whole thing as I did it in the car on the way home yesterday from Florida. So researching on my phone, typing on the computer. It's one way to stay awake. Push yourself a little bit on this run. Make yourself go, come on. Run it out. We gotta get back to our high knees again. And we're starting them up in just over 30 seconds. Looking at the clock going, when do I wanna start them, right? <laughs> come on. We're going to do it for 20 more seconds and then we're going to get into high knees. Ten seconds. Now, ten seconds. High knees start in three, two, one. Jacks are next. I'm like, did I do jumping jacks last time or did I go right into the jog? Honestly, don't remember. <laughs> Three, two, one, and jumping jacks. Pretty sure I did them. But if I didn't, we're doing them now. Did a find a lot of front arms today. And I've done my squats. I started waking up my lower body with the squats. Now, cardio. And then we gotta do plank still. Back to our run. Three, two, one, run down. All The key things to do in January too. Kind of one thing for me. I find myself stagnant through the day, and that's not good. I push myself really hard in the morning, then I don't do much through the day because of my job. I'm gonna find the time. I have a sit-standing desk. I can be working still. I'm gonna start marching in place. I'm gonna do something. Every hour on the hour, I'm gonna try two hour tops. But every hour on the hour, move that body through January. We need to check in with each other and see how we're doing with it too. Okay? Whether you check in with me on the Facebook community on the Facebook page or you check in with me on the community for YouTube page. Either way. Or maybe you're using Instagram or Twitter. Let's keep each other accountable. 
Let's do this. Come on. We're running it out right now. We're gonna do another series of these. This is supposed to be no copyright. I sure hope it still is because it's got words on it. So I sure hope it's no copyright music still. Or I'm in trouble if it's not, right? Yikes. I'd be muted. You'd be hearing me. See me talking, but no words are coming out. All right, so we're at the two minute mark. Let's push it for 30 more seconds. Then we'll get into the high knees again. Come on. I'm just filling the jog. One more run. I like in a pattern of it. I'm gonna push a little bit further. So, 10 seconds. We start with those high knees. In three, two, one. Get them up. Liquid. Imperial aversion. I'm a in the water head today. Coming from the high knees to the butt kickers next. Less than 10 seconds. Three, two, one, butt kick it. Jumping jacks, go for it. Well, a little over the butt kickers. So, just had to transition right into the jumping jacks. minutes right now. Let's go for a run. Come on. Okay, we were running and the SD card came full, so I started to get over again. Hopefully this is working. But I'm running it out. Come on. And I lost time because I had to delete the video that was on there. Should have deleted it before doing anything, right? And the actual juice is really low on the camera now too, so we'll see how we do. It cuts off again. Just remember, we're jogging it out. Then we're gonna do stretches. Let's jog it out for one more minute. Okay, come on. You can do this. Jog it out for a minute more. And then we're gonna get into stretches. Come on. Oh, you know me, roughly a minute, right? Never exact on these things. Sometimes it can be pretty close to being exact though. Just depends. Come on. Run it out. We're gonna take that run to jog here soon in just a minute. Or a few seconds. Three more seconds. Seconds. Come on. Three more seconds. We're gonna run it out hard. Come on. Put some effort into it. 30 seconds. Running to the finish line. Come on. Ten seconds. Sprint. Come on. All right. Take it down. Jog it out. Jog it. Thirty seconds. Jog. 
cardio, keep it going. Or we hit it. Do something else. There's several to choose from. You can put mine a couple days together to mix it up a little bit too. You don't have to just do this one over again. Walking it out. Three, two, one. Walk it down. Bring it down. seconds of walking. I'm ready for stretch. Stop. Step back with one leg. Push that heel to the floor. Get that calf. Go forward. Feel it in the quad and hip flexor. Arm straight back. Straight up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Down, all the way to the mat, drop the knee, flip the toes backwards, push forward, hold for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm liking the twist that I did the other day, hand on the mat, twist into it, really pull forward, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Both hands down. Step it back. Curl the toes. Push back. Stay on the dog. Walk the hands all the way back. Forward fold. All the way up. Opposite foot is back now. Push that heel to the mat. Feel that calf. Pull the hips forward. Feel it in the quad, in the hip. Hands straight back and straight up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hands come down, knee comes to the mat, curl the toes backwards, push into it. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Opposite hand to the mat. Twist into it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Both hands down. Step it back. Push it back to downward dog. Walk the hands back, forward fold, halfway lift this time, forward fold, all the way up. All right, again, repeat it if you have time. If not, check it off and say, it's done. <laughs> 